Good evening from the Carnival Liberty. It is going to be, well, a day. Um, we are sailing on a three night here on the Liberty, going to NASA on a day at sea. Unfortunately, our cruise was delayed. About eight hours. Yes, uh, the cruise did not leave Bimini until like 7 a.m. this morning due to winds uh, out of their control. So they did not begin boarding until about 6.30 p.m. Now, not something that's very common. No, it's and not common at all. Very frustrating as a guest, but now we're on board and I am ready to have a good time. Yes, and in this video, we're going to show you everything that we do, everything that we eat, everything that we drink, all the activities that we have. Awesome music and dancing. Yeah, we're going to have the best time. So follow along. With the late boarding, we decided to need the buffet instead of the main dining room. However, they are serving the late night buffet right now, which is mainly options off the main dining room. So I have vegetable lasagna, potato salad, I think that's pork loin, yes. uh, chicken quesadilla, and then chicken. And we also got Mississippi mud pie and I don't. Chocolate intensity? Chocolate intensity. And we're waiting for our first drink of the cruise. After eating at the buffet, we decided to go to the Elfing Bar since it is open, of course, since it's late at night. I went with my French Kiss, which is one of my favorite drinks here. And you went with an Old Fashioned, I believe? Yeah, the Island Old Fashioned, so it's made with Bacardi 8 rum. Really good. This is definitely our favorite bar on board. A lot of people too, apparently. Yes, it's very busy already. A welcome board show. Usually it introduces you to the crew staff, the cruise director, as well as comedians and your show performers. in a long, long time. We are finally here and we are on our way. Made a raid at the Common Club for a showing of just June. It's not super crowded in here, but you definitely feel the motion. And it's about 10 minutes before showtime. So maybe that has something to do with it. Maybe the motion, maybe the late arrival. Not 100% sure. But comedy up next. Day. A little movement this evening, but not as much as I thought with uh, them coming in the port seven hours late. We were eating a pizza for dinner. We got a pepperoni and a four cheese. I do have to say you have to feel the movement right now on the ship. Good morning. It is day two. We are headed to Nassau. We are moving. We are really moving. Definitely the 22 knots that the ship can handle. You feel every knot. You do. Uh, I got Polish sausages and we went with a breakfast burrito, our favorite. And now we are in the lobby playing trivia, general trivia. We are still in the lobby. We played general trivia, which we did pretty well. We got 13 points out of 20. The winning team got 14. Then we played catchphrase, which we did 16 but the winning team got a lot more than us. And now, I'm drinking martinis. Yeah, I'm drinking an apple teeny. You're drinking a tiramisu. And we are making paper airplanes for a competition right now. There are paper airplanes all over the floor right now. He got the second place. 
That's for Here's you. paper airplane. Congratulations, friends. Went the second. Come and pick up. You can tell it's a very windy and rough day at sea as they do not have the 11th deck, which has mini golf and the running track. Uh, it's not open because of the winds. I uh, wanted to go walk slash run on the jogging track, but that is closed. So I'm just going around on the deck while he gambles. Drinking a limited edition pumpkin ale. It's really good. Very interesting that they have Avatar on the free movie channel in the room. Usually it's more recent movies, but I guess they're probably doing it because Avatar 2 is about to come out. They have sex with their tails. The app said the Minions was playing, but it's actually the Grinch. Anyways, both good movies. We are going to spend some time in the pool or the hot tub, depending on how cold the pool is, watching the movie while we're at Nassau. We watched the entire Grinch movie while drinking a few drinks from the Red Frog rum bar by the pool. Now we are having a, sharing a second lunch. We got jalapeno cheddar hush puppies, some tacos from the blue iguana, we have chicken and pork, and we're drinking a dirty mojito. mojito. We have agreed the chicken taco much better than the pork taco. In the atrium, they're doing one hit wonders trivia. Drinking Kiss on the Lips, which is a frozen mango drink. Because I'm very hot from being outside. It's Nassau Day, and Nassau is always interesting because there's usually so many ships in one port. Of the, one of the busiest cruise ports in the entire world. Yes, there's five ships uh, here today. I think we've been on three of, three of the five. Three of the five. One that we have not been on is the Disney Wish. I want to go though. I would love to go on the Disney Wish. The Disney oh. ships always are pretty, except I'm not a huge fan of their slide up here. It, it's not pretty. Like the aqueduct is a much prettier slide than this one is. I agree. Yes. But I, I want to go on that ship. I want to have the Ant Man dinner. I want to have the Elsa dinner. I want to go to the Star Wars bar. Hopefully, we believe this ship is leaving at 5:15, so we're going to be upstairs. Hopefully, so we can hear the Mickey whistle. We decided to come upstairs and play some mini golf and watch Tangled. Sneaking on the wish. Nope, that was not a hole in one. I have completely failed at this mini golf. Oh no! As I was down by 11 at this hole. Oh no! Oh, come back! Never mind. Never mind. Let's see. Let's see. I got a seven. Okay, so I'm down by six at that. <laughs> Their course is really nice, though. No, very well kept. But be warned, this can be closed due to wind. Bring your own golf. If you have a golf ball, bring your own golf ball. Getting a few drinks at the Alchemy Bar. You got the youthful and bold. I got the basil drop. I do have to say it did take about 25 minutes for us to. We were told to go sit down and I saw people at the bar get service faster. But just know it might be a little bit of a wait, but they're really good drinks, so. Listening to a trio of violinists. I really love uh, violinists on oh, cruise wow. ship. Thank you. Thank you Captain's much. welcome with all the After officers of the ship. It's showtime in the main dining room, which I think is a very unique experience for Carnival. It adds some fun to the main dining room. <laughs> Dinner time in the main dining room. I got the pork tarts. And you got my entree, spaghetti carbonara, asking for a small portion. That is delicious. You'll see that in a second. Of course, I had to go with the spaghetti carbonara for my main entree. It is a little bit bigger portion than what he had, 
and you went with a prime rib for your entree with a baked potato. After dinner, we made our way down to karaoke and had to get a deal closer, of course, at the Alchemy Bar. In the theater today, they're playing Flick, which is one of my favorite carnival shows. Good morning, we're doing something different today. It is our last day and it's a day at sea. Normally we go to sea day brunch, but we decided to do the Zeus character breakfast. It just came back recently. Yeah. We haven't done this since, oh, probably like 10 years ago yeah, was the first time that we did this. So we're gonna see how it is. <laughs> they give you a yogurt parfait to start off with. With them, table by table for all our photographer uh, Jean, Jean Andre to take a picture. Food has arrived. I got French toast, Horton's French toast right. with cereal, and you got green eggs and ham. Who is that? The green to what? The green is here as well, my gosh. The green is here together with Jonathan, of course. We are cruising in December. They have some holiday activities. One is the holiday show. I love the holiday show. And if you have kids that are part of the kids clubs, they are in it. So encourage the kids to go has gone away, where all the good snowmen go on a sunny day. But he'll be back at your beck and call whenever great heaps of snowflakes will fall. And he will. That's a fact. Oh my goodness. It's snowing, everybody! Oh my goodness! Can you hold that? It's quite heavy. It's quite heavy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh! He's returned our captain's hat as well, everybody. Oh, how could you do something like that, Bridge? At the Blue Iguana Tequila Bar, and I'm drinking a green iguana. In the atrium, they just finished up Games of Thrones trivia. I will be honest, I've never seen Games of Thrones, so I did not participate, but the winning team did get all of them correct. And then, now there is holiday trivia, which I will be participating in. Probably my favorite thing about this trivia is that Grinch is doing picture meet and greets and he's dancing to all the songs. It's great watching him. <laughs> if you are a returning cruiser, make sure you pick up your pen at the Photoshop. in the casino uh, that is a tip sometimes they have good casino rates if you play enough money in the casino while he's doing that I'm taking a spin around the top deck trying to get some exercise trying to be good but it's gorgeous weather out here right now you can't see any land there's no boats just the water just the ocean carnival has a really good beer selection on board they also have their own beers he is drinking a Polner, and I'm drinking one of their own beers, a hard seltzer. There's two different hard seltzers. It's a pink colada and berry hibiscus. I believe these are new since the summertime. They also have a wheat beer and ales and ambers, all brewed uh, for Carnival in Lakeland, which is located between Orlando and Tampa. 
Not too far from us. We didn't share lunch at the buffet, so therefore we can get a burger maybe later. But look at this chicken. That chicken looks amazing. They have roast beef, which is a healthy, healthy size portion. Plenty of soda steak. Yes. And I'm excited for jalapeno cheddar mashed potatoes. For dessert, we are splitting a chocolate raspberry cake. I love chocolate and raspberry, so this should be good. Hopefully. It is Sunday, which means football Sunday. We are in the Skybox Sports Bar. They have four games on. Maybe five? I think it's four. It does get really crowded in here. If you want to see, make sure you get here early, probably an hour or so before. However, it's not as crowded as I thought. And we are going to be drinking a Skybox martini. And I'm winning at fantasy football. And he's winning at fantasy football. Yay. Up next, one of my favorite meals at Carnival is Guy's Burgers. We got the plain Jane with donkey sauce, asked for onion rings, and then we topped it off with potato sticks, as well as some uh, grilled onions. This is amazing. One of the best burgers at sea, I think. I think we're getting a big, big prize. Oh, here it comes. Here comes a big, big prize. Well, it says hours of bopping fun with the baba bird we just won. Ah, hours. Huh? Here it is. Hours of fun. Hours of fun. Baba bird. Back in the atrium, they have more trivia that we're playing. It's holiday trivia again. And they just finished up the family photo scavenger hunt around the ship. And I am drinking something amazing. It's a milkshake with some booze in it. So I got a strawberry milkshake with some Baileys. It's really good. And it's covered by the Bainbridge plan. I think one of my favorite musicians on any ship is the Vinylist. And they sound really good. Before heading to dinner, we are watching the sunset. Looks like it's going to be a good one. Yeah, it's always awesome watching the sunset from the sea and the ocean. One of the, like, the simple it's, joys of cruising. Yeah, it's so peaceful out here. Hopefully so pretty. ugly oil tanker doesn't get in the way. Yeah, there's one right over here. It probably will by the time the sun sets. Oh well. Appetizer time here in the main dining room. I went with a classic Caesar salad. You again did not like any of the appetizers, so you went with short ribs. Main entree, I got the enchiladas. And you went with the fried chicken, which is one of my favorites. Dessert, I went with the carnival melting chocolate cake. And I got a side of peanut butter because I have been told to get a side of peanut butter. And I listened this time to my friend. And you went with a baked Alaska. We just got out of the Punchliner Comedy Family Show. It was really good. Up on deck 10, we are now in the steakhouse. Not to eat dinner, but to have a few drinks. They do have different type of alcohol up here. I'm drinking a watermelon martini, but you are drinking a uh, Blanton's uh, bourbon. Yes, they have a good bourbon and whiskey. It's a variety up here. They have an 80s trivia music party. Look at his outfit. He has quite the outfit. There is 14 songs. It's not really trivia, it's more like a sing-along. It has turned into a dance party. And the fun squad is currently in the elevator. That's amazing. We are sharing a buffalo chicken sandwich from the deli. However, we customized it with the pretzel bun and adding cheese. Of course, they have a love and marriage show in the main theater.
Comedy Lounge for one more show. And that will do it for our time on the Carnival Liberty. I really enjoyed the ship with the Christmas activities. I'm glad the Dr. Seuss characters and activities are back. And who doesn't love the Flick show? It's such a good show. If you have any questions, uh, please comment down below. And thank you so much for watching.